सर सेवरल क्वेश्चन्स रेज्ड रिगार्डिंग द डिफेन्स मिनिस्ट्री अँड द एक्सटर्नल अफेअर्स अँड इरिगेशन मिनिस्ट्रीज हॅव बीन क्लॅरिफाईड बाय माय कलिग्स फ्रॉम दोज मिनिस्ट्रीज माय टास्क देअर फोर हॅज बीन सिम्प्लिफाईड टू दॅट एक्सटेंट बिफोर आय गो टू द क्वेश्चन्स फायनान्शियल अँड इकॉनॉमिक रेस्ड बाय सेवरल ऑनरेबल मेंबर्स आय शूड लाईक टू क्लॅरिफाय वन ऑर टू पॉईंट्स विच आर मोर ॲडमिनिस्ट्रेटिव्ह दॅन इकॉनॉमिक ऑर फायनान्शियल वन ऑफ देम वॉज रेज्ड बाय माय ऑनरेबल फ्रेंड ही रेज्ड द क्वेश्चन अबाउट द रिक्रुटमेंट बाय द असिस्टंट सुप्रिटेंडंट्स डिपार्टमेंटल कॉम्पिटिटिव्ह एक्झामिनेशन अँड पर्टिक्युलरली अबाउट द एक्झामिनेशन हेल्ड इन नाईन्टीन सिक्स्टी ही सेड दॅट अबाउट रुपीज सिक्स लॅक्स वर स्पेंड फॉर द नाईन्टीन सिक्स्टी एक्झामिनेशन अँड लॅटर इट वॉज डिक्लेअर्ड दॅट नो वॅकन्सीज वर अवेलेबल ही देअर फोर सजेस्टेड दॅट अ डेफिनाईट प्रोसिजर शूड बी देअर अँड द एक्झामिनेशन शूड बी हेल्ड अकॉर्डिंग to the vacancies declared in advance and all persons who have qualified in that examination should be eligible for promotion or for appointment para sir i do not know whether the honorable member knows how these vacancies are filled he probably refers to the section officers grade in the central secretariat service this is filled 50% by direct recruitment and 25% by departmental competitive examination open to the assistants that is the next lower grade and the rest 25% by promotion of the assistants on the basis of seniority subject to fitness the examination therefore that he was referring to was a departmental competitive examination for filling 25% of the vacancies it takes about 1 year for the union public service commission to declare the results of the examination from the time they take up the question of the examination it is not therefore possible to declare the number of vacancies to be filled in from the very beginning to declare them just when the results are out is more realistic and that is wha- what is done sir if the examination is treated as qualifying examination the number of persons who will thus become eligible for appointment will be quite unrelated to the number of vacancies to be filled in and then the very situation which the honorable member wishes to avoid would arise it would not then be possible to hold any of the examinations at regular intervals and promotions against these quota would become very fitful over